Uh, so the topic today we are doing actually, uh, sorry, no, actually email and or letter. They are all the same. So, so now you are given this. Uh, you have received an email from your Kaizen. So what is about? Give a look this one. What is the topic? Read this part of email when you write an email to your Kaizen. I'm going to visit you for a week. It's going to be the great. Isn't it? First, can you let me know a bit, a bit later about your house and family? Also, can you let me know the sleeping arrangements? So generally, what is the topic about? Traveling or visiting? Visiting. Visiting. Visiting, yeah, visiting, yeah. So the topic is visiting, right? So the person is cousin. So here is visit. I'm going to visit. Okay, visit. All right, Lexi, here, see you, Sam. Okay, Sam has written this letter to you. So who is Sam? Sam is your friend, cousin? You not what? Cousin. Cousin, yeah, your cousin. Okay, cousin, brother or sister? Sam. It can be both. He or she, brother or sister? Sisters. Brother can be sister as well. Sam, they are. They usually Sam is brother. Okay, okay. Cousin visiting here, right? Okay. Dear Sam, okay. This is Sam is first name or last name? First name or last name? Last name or son name? Uh, first name. First name. For example, chat in Raja. Chat is like Sam, first name, right? So when you are, this is formal letter or informal letter? Uh, informal letter. Informal letter. That's why we can write first name, right? First name, dear Sam, dear Ta, dear Ta, dear Ao, like this. Yeah, Ta Ta Ao. Ta Ta Ao, do need to join now. Okay, dear Sam, okay. So here, <clears throat> this one is introduction, right? So introduction, what, what, how it is, how is it written? Let's give a look. Lovely to get. Please to please you come in. The two points, yeah. First one is get your email. Lovely or nice, or you can say that. The second one is please you are coming. You are coming or you are going to come. Yeah. This one is. And true. So according to the question, right? Question me, I'm going to visit you. Now, uh, I'm pleased you are coming. You are coming to visit or you are coming to stay with us. This is and true, right? So easy, right? So he is coming. So you are coming. I, I'm pleased. So I'm, I'm pleased. I'm happy. So I got, I, I got, I received your email. I got your receipt, yeah. Okay. Get me receipt, okay? Okay, I... Uh, so we should we should remember uh, we should take a note this the first uh, introduction sent next to me it, it was lovely to receive your email it was nice to receive your email yesterday and I am pleased I am I'm am so happy okay you are coming to stay with us so according to their uh, statement we are given so this is the key point 
what does he want to do? What is he asking? Do you remember the question? So do you remember the question? What is he asking about? He is coming to visit us. Okay, he wants to know. Uh, about your family and family and house. And about the family and house. And where he asks, can he stay? Can he stay? He can he stay? Can he stay uh in your house or not? Yeah, that's why. Would you like to know something about my house and family? So respond to the statement. Do you want to know? Would you like to know? What is different? Do you want to know is for informal? Would you like to know is formal? It means that you are giving respect to your cousin. You are a good sister. <laughs> yes. So informal way or writing. Oh, yeah. Okay. Next. Yes, students, give a look at this one. This black one. What is written? What is the key point? Would you like to know? I have no house. Not like that. <laughs> we live in a big five bedroom. So it means that there are, uh, in my house, there are five bedrooms. But it is not a good idea. So we better write it like that. A big five bedroom. This is a big bedroom, five bedroom. There is no S here. A big five, five bedroom is compound now. Big five bedroom, there is no S. But that's why bedroom house. There's a house, big five bedroom house, a house. So where is the house? On the house castle? Where? How? How the situation, the house, how and where, another one is better to make sentence longer. How, where, this is one sentence. So where's your house? Your house is big or small? Yeah? Where's your house? Your house is big or small. So where and eh? how's your house? Okay. And then it can be a bit quiet here. What is it here? So your house, your house, Where's your house situated? At the environment or surrounding? Quiet? Quiet or noisy or? Okay. And but you can easily catch a bus and the town. He catch a bus me transport, right? Transport is the transport is easy to go to go to downtown, to go to university. Yeah. So what else do you want to say? But you have to write 140 to 190, right? So we do not write it. We don't need to write it long. So, okay. So think about your house. How, where, the environment, and transport. That's better. Yeah. All right. So, so remember? Yeah, that's it. And then? Uh, yes. Imagination. We can use your imagination. Okay. And then, uh, what is, what this, what is this paragraph about? Uh, what is the key point? Let's see. Yeah. <laughs> Our own rooms. <clears throat> what kind of room is this? Bedroom, right? Bedroom. So there are five bed, big bedrooms. It means that a big five bedroom house. That's why right. our own rooms. Yeah. This is this one. This one is very kind of 
and then a spare room yeah if you can stay uh you can stay with me and uh, if not there is or we have there is or we have a spare room yeah yeah all right so give more information Okay, now let's see. So how, how about this paragraph? What is the information? Family member, little brother. <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> little brother. <clears throat> so fam house and family, there's a uh, house and family. How information, the house is finished, right? Big five bedroom. Uh, we have our own room, spare room. Yeah. Uh, the house is near blah blah and transport is okay so the information information is given about house about your house another one a family member so we don't need to organize it explain every details of family member so only there organize it only uh only only a few or a few are family member so you went okay by the way brother Brother, what what uh what how, how can I say uh what does your brother sorry how is uh what is your brother like your brother what is your brother like what does he look like his appearance not not here is not appearance what is your brother like me his character his state of mind okay what is your brother like here is Trick, play, tricks on people. So he is naughty. Your life. <laughs> Be careful when you come. <laughs> Be careful when you come. Okay. Loves playing tricks on people. So watch out for the first few days. Later, you'll be all right. Yeah. So brother. Okay. How about daddy? How about mommy? Another one is, uh, what is the next paragraph about? More information. Mom, right? Mom, uh, what can your mom do? He's very good at cooking, right? You won't go hungry. It means that? You won't go hungry. It means that my mom can cook yummy food, uh, delicious food, yeah? So, yeah. Uh, you'll be pleased to know my man is a great cook and you won't go hungry. So, yeah, my man is quite good at cooking. Okay, so talking about man. Okay, talking about brother. Play on trick and play tricks on people. My man is a good cook. Yeah, great cook. Yeah. Again, how about your dad? What what can, what does your daddy do? What is his hobby or what is his uh, habit? Of? Going out for long walks. <clears throat> so before he comes, uh, he should have known some information about family member. Okay, uh, family member. Uh, he's go loves going out. So, uh, how can I say, walking boots. If you like walking with hand, so bring walking boots, you like that. So one person, one point only, and one person, one, one key information. 
So brother, what what does what organize it? Um what 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 does he do or what can what is his habit or hobby? Man, habits or hobby, daddy, habits or hobby. That's it. Or family member. So okay. We just just, just a key twice only, yeah. Okay, so we have already mentioned the information about information, uh, information of the house and information, side information of the family members. And then, um, how can I say? So we are going to end our, our, our okay, letter or email. So anyway, uh, uh, I hope this gives you an idea about us. You are excited about Kami. Yeah, the key point here is Kami. Kami, this give you idea. Idea is me that whether you will like Kami or not. Okay. Idea I mean whether you will like coming to visit or not. Okay. So this give an idea. So I've already mentioned about my family members and some of my family members and uh some information about my house. That's why the, you can you take it, organize it. Uh, it means that you can get the idea. So, okay. yeah. So, whether it is good or not. Yeah, generally, uh, uh, how can I say that it seems good? Yeah, quite good or good or that, like this. Any question about this? Yeah, the whole one. Yeah. The whole pair. How many pair? One, two, three. Yeah, four. All the best. And your 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 first name here, Will or Willie and uh your first name on um, Ted Ted like this. Okay. Yeah. All the best or uh, see you or like this. Yeah. Best wishes or see you or yeah, the next one here. Yeah. If you don't have any question, we are moving to exercise. And then we have to write a simple email on our own. Yeah, within 20 minutes. Yeah, so first opening, first organization, first one, eh, we give a salutation here. So to pay respect to somebody, DSM, it was blah, blah, this is intro, opening sentence. And then paragraph is talking, giving, and giving or replying the main information. Body paragraph one, body paragraph two, and then ending. That's it, right? And then uh all the best. Well is your name and how can I say that? Compliment complete complete. Uh, how can I say compliment? Compliment. All the best. No compliment. Okay. If you don't have any question, let's move to uh exercise yeah before doing a uh, writing the whole the whole email or letter uh we are going to do exercise so, so it seems it seems easier or better right now i i am going to choose a, a similar topic here yeah. biggest in visit a uh, place to visit try to get 10 months Oh no, where are we now? Sorry. <clears throat> again. What? You have received an email from an English friend, Sam, again. <laughs> no similar, same, the name is same. I'm so excited about coming to visit this summer for a, for a week, for a few weeks. I'm It's going to be great, isn't it? First, I like to visit some places where you like to go. 
I like to be some places where you like to go. Uh, <laughs> not, not the same, this one. Okay, I like to do some shopping. Can you tell me a little bit about where you might do these things together? So what is the main topic about? Visit, right? Yeah, the same visit. And then what is the key information? Uh, what is the paragraph, the main body paragraph we are going to respond? Some places. Yeah, so you like to go. You are this place, you are also interested in this place. The next one is some places for what? To do shopping. To do some shopping. So you tell me a bit about where you might do. You tell me about where you might do this thing together. So you and your you and your friends, right? English friends, Sam. Yeah, not cats and this time. Right? Okay. Awesome. Then we are going to move to uh it's a site. Oh, sorry. What's happening? Hmm. I'm glad you are coming. Uh, the answer is, so let's play the, uh, fill the blank. I'm coming, I'm glad you are coming. The answer is A or B or C or no, there is no, no ABC, right? We are, we are, okay, we are giving our own answer. Yeah, I'm coming, I'm glad you are coming. Bath or now or as it is. You are coming. Visit me for holiday. We are going to have great time. You can be sure that. What is the answer here first? We are going to put the answer here. Hello? Are you thinking? Oh, what? Can you see my page? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm I think you don't see my page. Okay. You are just giving, uh, how can I say? You seem a little bit, how can I say that? I like a statue. <laughs> I'm happy you are coming. Okay. I'm happy you, I'm glad you are coming. I'm pleased you are coming. Visit my holiday, for my holiday. We are going to one, one vocabulary. What do you want to put here? To fill here? Skip? You know, I'm coming to. To, yeah, coming to, all right? Coming to, coming to visit me. Coming to visit, and then how about number two? Have a great time. <laughs> have a great time, that's better, yeah. Have a great time, yeah. We are going to have a great time, good time, yeah? So what are you doing there? You can be sure of that. And let me tell you about the places where I like to hang. Hang out. Oh. Hang out. The body paragraph will hang out. In the first place is our look at coffee shop. All my friends meet coffee shop. The first place, right? Excellent coffee, reasonable prices. So the first place is coffee shop. So coffee shop, wine, excellent coffee, and sandwiches, reasonable price, 
prizes. Most are the ones. Coffee shop. Most are the ones. You see a key part here. More. Yeah. Sorry. More are than. More, more than. That's right. More yeah. than. Oh, more than. More than. Yeah. More than. Sorry. More than. More than other shops. Other ones. Another favorite tries to the park, which is which is yeah, the best, 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 the best, best, right? Right, the best place to go. Another choice, what is another choice? Park, right? Another place is park. The first place is coffee. Coffee me, uh, excellent coffee, sandwiches. Man, if you know cappuccino, if you know more more about coffee, the name of coffee that you that's better you mentioned. Um Okay, uh, sandwiches. Me. Another favorite choice is park. The best place. Why? A place for a long walk. Long uh, walk along the river. Oh, there's a river. And then outdoor activity. So that's why park is good. The next, as far shopping. As far. As far. As far, yes. As far as, as far as far as me to talk about shopping, as far as shopping, to talk about shopping, as far as shopping, 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 shopping goals, as far as shopping goals, the high streets in my town has a variety, clothing shop, varieties me like various, right, various exit form. So variety is noun form. A variety be different like this. A variety preposition unique. Preposition. Variety of oh yeah. Variety of yeah. Of variety of me various. A various clothing shows me variety of me various the same right. So variety me uh what is variety? Shopping variety means sports shops, music shops, gift shops, variety. So different kinds of uh variety of clothing shops. Yeah, yeah. What is? It's cooler. Shopping center is cooler. And um, convenient than walking up and down High Street. Walking up and down. More. Convenient. You can see here, then. More. Uh, more than, okay. More than, okay. More convenient. Cooler and more convenient, yeah. I'm all right, more, okay. Oh, no. Oh, Sunday. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Actually, no, I'm objection. Okay, number nine, ten, only two. I'm sure you will find more things to do. The last paragraph. Okay. You'll find more things to do while you are here. More things. Oh, I don't I don't I don't mention about about those more things. This is a give this this is to give you some idea. Hmm. Yeah, some idea. Like the first one, this idea, whether you would like coming or not. So let me know if you want more information. More information. I look forward to seeing you. Cool. Yeah, this is the ending. I'm sure you're fine. You'll find more things to do. How many more things? A few or some or many? Um, many more things. Many more things, possible. Many more things to do, you are here. 
Many more than some more than. Yeah, what do you like? Which one do you prefer? Many or some? Money. 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 All right, so let's write it down. I'm eight. Many. So this gives you an idea, some idea whether you like coming or not. Okay, now let, let me know. Let me know. Uh you want any more information? Hmm? If if you want. Oh yeah, if you want. If you want more information, let me know. So I'll give you, yeah. I look forward to seeing you. Exclamation. Because you're your friend, yeah. You are excited. See you soon. So you are going to write your name here. So your your first name, not the full name, right? First name only. Cat or like it all or like it. Okay. So let's check. Oh, okay. Okay. Check. Are we all correct? Yeah, all correct. Excellent. Good job. Okay. So any question about this one? The first one is opening. This is opening uh, sentences. Body paragraph one, two. So body paragraph one, two is opening sentences. As we know, you you are coming. Your friend is coming. So have a great time. So this is intro one, right? So ne the next one, is, as you know, this is this paragraph. Is, what is this paragraph about? Places, right? So places. First places, another places of park. Another one activity, second paragraph activity also is that shopping. And then you give a reason why you want to go there. The next one is and then paragraph. Yeah. Any paragraphs give the idea. If you want more information, look forward to seeing you. That's it. Yeah. So yeah. So whether it is good idea or good, it is good. Uh, Amy, uh, it's kind of, writing is like that. Writing means we have to respond to that information. So your friend asking, your cousin asking, somebody asking. Okay. Uh, so I uh, can I give you this one as your homework? Yeah? So yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. As a homework is uh, how can I say? So so you need to write down the question. Question. Wait a minute. Um, sorry, uh, yeah, yeah, this is a question. So here, take it, get a second shot here. You receive an email from your English friend's son. Read also this letter here. Some places you like to go. And the focus on a short day. Finish. Finish. 